Hello guys, this is Sanofan again from Take Chaplin and this video I'm going to tell you about how to fix the Wi-Fi connection problem on your Windows 10. So the other days I was checking my Wi-Fi router, the connection is down, you know, I can't access some of the websites that I want to. I see after resetting my computer I see that my Wi-Fi network isn't working isn't working at all and then uh, it has a small yellow triangle showing on that so here is a possible way that you can fix it the first step you want to go and right click on this Wi-Fi connection and open network and sharing center now click on change adapter settings where you can see uh, the current use network connection so here I'm currently using this Wi-Fi connection and I'm gonna right click on that and click on properties and there we go we have the IPv4 internet protocol version 4 so click on that and choose properties again okay oh uh, guys here we have obtain IP address automatically so I'm currently set as obtain IP address automatically. You want to check on your computer if it is currently you use the, the specific IP address or physical IP address on your computer. So the way is you can switch in between this or use this alternatively. So for example, I'm currently using obtain IP address automatically and the Wi-Fi is working but if i change it and using this this specific ip address then that will be showing the yellow triangle so if you are currently using you seeing the number set number uh, the number set here and your wi-fi uh, icon here showing that is a little yellow triangle then you go in here and choose the obtain ip address automatically but if you're currently using is obtain IP address automatically but the triangle the yellow triangle is still here and here's the step to do find out the specific IP address that you want to put in so the next step is for the alternative way we're gonna go and search and we're gonna go and search for command prompt so you just see uh, type in command prompt and it will be showing here you know right click on that and click run as administrator okay now we're gonna type in IP config and hit enter so guys here now we have our IP config um, we're gonna see the detail of the IP address here so we're gonna search for and we'll see IPv4 address and you won't have to remember this number you can write it down or you can just you know minimize this a little bit smaller or maybe drag it that down there and you'll be seeing this and you wanna go and click on this and you wanna input that so we wanna input that number in so like that, 192, 168, okay, 1371, and just click on this place, and it will be showing the subnet maps automatically. What about the default gateway? Okay, so default gateway, you're gonna leave it as a blank, okay? So that's it guys, so you want to click on OK, then you will click on OK here again, one more time, then it will be working. So that's it guys, thanks so much for watching this video, I am Anfan, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel.